Hey, hey, hey guys, what is up? My name is TechnoVirgin and welcome back to a new video. So, uh, I've been trying to play Battlefield 4, 3, Hardline, all those good things uh, for the past year, I think. A couple of months, I think at least between uh, the beginning of this year and now. I haven't been able to log into Origin, so I had to uninstall it and I attempted to reinstall it where it went halfway through the updating process and then crashed without telling me why and then the next time that I did it went halfway through once again and then crashed and said hey you should go download origin setup from our website and uh, I did that and it was a waste of 100 megs back then and uh, a couple more times now so this is the one that I downloaded just now and this is the one that you download off their website um, but neither of these work which is sad, especially if you have a capped internet connection, you end up downloading this one three or four times. You're gonna have a problem with your internet. So, if yours goes halfway through, crashes, or has any other problem with updating, there's one simple easy way to solve that. So you're gonna have to download the Origin Thin setup, and then wait until it goes to at least halfway or whenever it crashes. Make sure that it at least downloads a little bit. Go to C program data slash origin slash self update. And inside of here, you will find a origin update underscore followed by a whole bunch of numbers dot zip dot part. So this is the download that it's trying to currently create. And the, uh, you'll have to remember origin update underscore whatever it is dot zip. So you'll have to copy that all the way from origin update to dot zip. And then you're going to have to go to download.dm.origin.com uh, forward slash origin forward slash beta forward slash and then the name of the zip file that you were downloading. Hit enter and it should start the download in whatever browser you're in. Uh, as you can see here, 91.3 megs. Uh, it's a little bit smaller than the one that I had downloaded before, about 111 megs. No idea why, but uh, as long as you run this once, you'll be fine. After that, and after this is done downloading, I already have it downloaded. All right, so now I have the origin uh, one that I downloaded, the origin zip that I just downloaded off the website. And uh, here it is, I open it up with WinZip, uh, WinRAR, sorry. You can open it up with uh, any sort of zip operating thing. I'm pretty sure Windows comes in uh, with one that allows you to do it anyway in the normal file explorer, but uh, Anyway, that's for you to figure out. So once you ha once you have this downloaded, open this up in a little window and then head across to C, colon forward slash program files, and then navigate to origin, which mine is located in C, program files uh, 86, forward slash origin. And uh, inside of here, you're gonna need to select any files that are inside of this uh, directory over here and either delete them or cut them to another location but make sure that there are absolutely no files inside of this. Now I'm not actually going to do that because I have a working copy that I spent maybe 30 seconds unzipping and everything. So anyway, highlight everything from the zip and drag and drop it into the empty folder that is now inside of program files 86 slash origin. And uh, yeah, after that, open up the origin.exe, I think it is. Yes, origin.exe, you may need to run as administrator or even in compatibility mode like you have uh, before you started having this problem. And uh, it should be able to work 100%. Uh, I haven't seen anything wrong with this, but uh, if it tries to update again, head back to the origin slash self update and empty the self update folder completely like I have here. It should do it by itself, but if it doesn't and it just crashes again, try that and try copying everything across again. And yeah, that should fix the launch problem with uh, Origin or the update problem. Whatever kind of problem you're having, it should fix it. It's clean as all of Origin. Uh, yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed. Hope this helps you. And uh, remember to subscribe for some more useful videos. I'll see you all in the next one. But one final thing before I leave, this is a little edit. Uh, all the links that you will need are down in the description below, including the uh, link to the Origin Update website and uh, probably the installation uh, location for Origin itself 
and also the program with artist. So if you're too lazy to, to uh, do it yourself, just copy paste and you should be fine. So yeah, anyway, peace.